guys. So, I'm going to try and get back into reactions. I thought I'll do this one now because I kind of want to get my proper reaction to it. Godzilla versus King Kong. I want to be able to say that I actually enjoyed it. And, you know, some parts I did. I did enjoy it. But, I want to say, like I said, I want to say I enjoyed it. But I can't honestly say I enjoyed it 100%. Unfortunately, it's... <sighs> I'm going to say I enjoyed it about... I, it was, I, to be fair, it was about 50-50 that I enjoyed it. And it hurts that I only enjoyed it about half of the, half of the time. Mainly because... It... it I don't know. It, in some ways, nothing happened. There was a big build-up, multiple build-ups to potential scenes, which just never happened. I, I will warn now: spoilers from this point onwards. If you haven't seen it, so click off, watch it, come back, whatever. But spoilers from this point onwards, you've been warned. Um. What was I saying? Yeah, I mean, bit at the beginning, near enough-ish at the beginning, you got him, Kong, being able to do sign language. And the first thing we see him do, or translate or whatever, is that he's sad. Which kind of puts in, in my head, it was, okay, well clearly something's going to happen to him, he's now got emotions, he can talk so yeah in my head boom oh, okay so he's gonna die no that do doesn't happen he goes off and lives in the hollow earth I'm assuming being the alpha of that bit big old build up to a fight with a giant robot Godzilla doesn't even last that long I mean probably about five ten minutes that's in, that, that's the whole fight as well, and it kind of just ends. Kong rips his head off, and then they go their separate ways, N with no mention of what these two have just done, destruction-wise. Nothing. I don't like the fact that Godzilla smiles twice. It's a bit weird, it's a bit creepy, to be honest. It looks weird, he's not supposed to smile. I'm pretty sure to be able to smile you have to have lips, and I'm pretty sure he doesn't have lips. <sighs> Question that my mum had. Where's all this stuff come from in the hollow off? Who built it all? Where did it all come from? None of that was explained. It was, in my opinion, it kind of felt rushed. And... Another thing that my mum said, it felt like two completely different films. She didn't know what was going on. And yes, nothing was really explained. At all. Yes, we found out that Kong wasn't the wasn't the person, well, wasn't the titan that Godzilla was going for. We found that out. And we had a little bit of a, um, like a bonding moment between the two. When he realises, okay, you're not the one I'm looking for. I'm going to leave you alone now, even though I've just tried to kill you most of the film. I'm going to leave you alone. My only screen time has been attacking you. But I'm going to forget you now. And go off and do something else. Um, and then, obviously, they find, or he finds, the source of this rival alpha that he's been looking for. Hence all the destruction that he's been causing. He's been going for these spots in the planet that have had this um, alpha 
noise thing that was in King of the Monsters. And it kind of just ended. And there was no post credit scene, or I don't know, maybe there was, I don't know. But, yeah. In my opinion, I'm going to have to say, if you, if you want to watch it, don't worry yourself too much. Don't get so hyped about it, I'm going to say. Because it's like when you're a kid at Christmas, you get hyped up about it, and it's over, and then you're just sad and depressed. Don't get hyped up about it if you really want to watch it. Promise, I promise you, do not get hyped. Because it's not a hyped film. It really isn't. It feels rushed. None of the scenes really, like, connect. I'm not sure why. They just don't feel like they're meant to be together, and it just doesn't feel like a complete film. It feels like there's bits missing completely. Hopefully they're not doing that on purpose to release a... Z Monsterverse Director's Cut or whatever, which is actually a six hour Godzilla vs King Kong film. With all the bits that we actually wanted. I don't know. But, anyway, that's my... Reaction and review, maybe just reaction. I might not do the reaction and reviews. Anyway, that's my reaction to Godzilla vs. King Kong. Like I said, if you want to watch it, don't get hyped about it because you're just gonna you, you're not you're gonna you're gonna leave it unpleased. But anyway, let me know in the comments what you thought of the film if you've seen it already, what your worries are if you haven't seen it. Um, leave a like if you did enjoy the video. And I'll see. See you in the next one. Hopefully, I'm going to try and be starting to do some more of these because I kind of miss doing these. So, see you in the next one.